probably familiar with our hot picks section of the program. Are you familiar with hot picks as chosen by AI? Increasingly, artificial intelligence is influencing Wall Street. Doug Clinton is the founder and CEO of Intelligent Alpha, which is incorporating AI into its investment uh, picking practices. Doug, it's great to see you. Thanks for the time. Thank you, John. Let's uh, let's very quickly before we get into what the AI is recommending right now. Uh, very quickly, how does this all work, John? We use the uh, leading large language models, so models like GPT, Gemini, Claude that you've probably heard of, to essentially do stock analysis and portfolio management, just like human stock analysts and PMs do, and we end up with portfolios that we think over time can outperform traditional stock pickers. Okay, so let's start going through some of the examples. Gold got uh, the AI nod of approval. Tell us a little bit more about that. Yeah, thankfully, since the beginning of the year, our models have been fans of the gold trade. So coming into the year, our Livermore ETF LIVR had a relatively decent position in gold mining stocks and other commodity stocks like that. We actually added GLD, so just straight gold exposure, right around the time the tariff turmoil happened. And AI, it's backed off a little bit on gold, but it still does like it as a hedge as we figure out what happens with tariffs here. Okay, it also found a tech play with strong ties to Latin America, Mercado Libre, which is uh, M-E-L-I on the NASDAQ. Give us the backstory there. So we also asked our models coming into this year, what's your favorite geography to invest in in 2025? And the answer was Latin America. And so far, that's been a pretty good call by AI. Latin American stocks are up a little over 25% year to date. One of the best performers has been Melly, which is, you know, basically think of it as the best internet company that's serving Latin American customers. It's the Amazon of Latin America. And I think there's continued growth there. AI still likes Latin America as a region to invest in. Okay, and this next one is a bit meta, not meta as in Facebook meta, but just in you using AI. AI to uh, find out what kind of AI investments might be worth your investing dollars. Uh, you did just that. It looks like Marvell popped out of the machine. It did. AI, the theme AI, has been loved by the technology AI in our case. The models have had that as one of its conviction sort of themes to invest in since we started the company. And Marvell is one, that name hasn't really worked so far yet this year. But if you think about the backdrop with Marvell, the stock hasn't performed. There's been questions about whether they might lose some business from one of their big custom silicon customers, which is Amazon. The company, I think, addressed that somewhat on the last earnings call. And AI is making the bet that, look, if anything goes right here for this stock, it's probably a good winner from the AI trade. We're almost out of time, and it's still the early days of AI, but you've had a long career talking to investors, being an analyst, covering companies. What are your biggest takeaways from launching this business and incorporating AI into stock picking? The thing I tell everybody when they're, they're thinking about AI is that you can't really understand how quickly things are moving until you're living in it, until you're building products in the space, because you hear about how fast things are going, but it's going faster than anybody can really express. And I would tell you, every month at Intelligent Alpha, it feels like a new advanced model comes out. We have to kind of update and tweak our process to take advantage of that. And I think it's great for the overall process because these models just get smarter and smarter and smarter, and it should result in better returns in the long run. Doug, really appreciate your time. Thanks as always. Doug Clinton is founder and CEO of Intelligent Alpha.